Hello and welcome to another LSPEC training video. Today we'll finish up our overview module. In our previous videos we covered the map view where you can add meters to a map. We covered using a CAD drawing or a JPEG to add values to your objects. And today we're going to finish up the rest of the features. So we'll go back to map view. And over here on the sides, you've got your power quality, your fault recorder, and your system. For the most part, these are all default values that are either featured in your systems tab or inside the meter itself. What you can do, you can hide these modules to expand your view if you want to and show them. If you hover your mouse over in this blue area right here, you get a little extended arrow. Drag and drop. And on the fault recorder, right here at the wrench, preferences, you can select how long you want to see them. And you could also modify, remove, change any of the actual faults that you're seeing. So if all you are interested in in your system is sags or swells. You could remove everything except for these two. That way at a glance all you'll see is what you actually care about. Um, that is also something I would I would highly recommend doing um, to create a more flowing space. Um, we went over this area here in the, in the first video showing where all your meters are stored and how you can configure them. And now what we're going to show is the list view. Now this is a very simple view. It allows you to just look at your names. Nothing fancy. Gives you the option to click on your reports, your faults, um, the different uh, information you're looking for here. Um, this is not really a configurable page. This just pulls its information from everything else. But for people who just like a straight, I want to just glance right down it and I don't want to have to search for different variables. This is a good page to do it. Um, the next thing we want to show is the different types of views. Split vertically or horizontally. So we'll split this horizontally and then we're going to change this view To a different one down here okay so this allows you to have two or three different views or you can go up here and you can have two different line drawings of your different of your system um, zoomed out zoomed in uh, to get a better view of what you're looking at um, you can actually split this into four views as well Either by just adding these to it or not, or from the original, we'll close these windows out here. A four view, and each of these windows are configurable. So you can have a drawing here, you can have list view down here, um, here you can have one side of the world and here you can have the other side of the world. So it's it's a very configurable map viewing system. It allows you to really get in and do what you want to do with with your views. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube to keep up to date with all of our videos. Be sure to connect with us on LinkedIn and like us on Facebook. Have a great day.